Hi, this is Borks, and hello, welcome. Welcome back if you've been here before. So today, guys, we're gonna do a video on how to clean, how to clean up and repair secondhand baby dolls, secondhand dolls, guys. How I clean them, my tips and tricks. So hope you guys enjoy because I've been cleaning dolls like this for many, many years now, and it's a pretty good method. Okay, guys. Dude, let's get in the video. So, guys, this is Erica. She is a Madam Alexander. I got her a year and a half ago for my birthday, and she's been sitting. In a bag. Ow. You guys hold on, guys. I can't just want to hand it. Yeah, guys, I like to check all of her exposed skin first, guys. I actually really wet this magic eraser, guys. Also, don't use magic eraser. If you don't know how to do it, guys, magic eraser can actually take off face paint because it is sandpaper, guys. A little bit. Look how clean Erica is getting. She didn't even look dirty. Also, guys, if don't use any of my techniques unless you're doing it with your own regard. Because I am not responsible what you do to your doll. Miss Erica has been using her bath well. My daddy can't help me right now with her because... She's downstairs. She's not feeling well. She made guys. Careful, because this can take off paint. Can take off their hair and other cute details. Okay, guys, I'm gonna do this fully and get back to you. So guys, this one step is done. Look how dirty Miss Erica was. I didn't think she looked that dirty. So cloth gets dirty. I really don't care about this. We're gonna wash anyway. The next step is to wash her down with. Soap. Do that, okay. I'm going to do that in the bathroom and see her. I don't have a tripod. I don't want to get anything on my tablet. I would have to show you guys her in the bucket. So, guys, her dress. I'm going to toss it into. I'll show you. So, guys, this is what I did, guys. By the way, my tub is old. So, it's not. My tub is old. So, it's not dirty. There's Erica in her bucket. And there's her clothes in the bucket. And guys, I washed Erica's body with like soap and explained it in. Let her soak in here for for a little bit. And Erica's gonna go downstairs and try the line. Okay, guys. So look at when she's complete. So guys, this is Vlogoween Day 14. Guys, I'm gonna show you guys how I washed Erica. I put her in the powell and swished her around. Sorry, guys, my rash is getting worse. And then I rinsed her really good under the shower, and then I laid her over here to dry out. I know, guys, my other dolls are in the way at the moment, and I think I may have found my Harry Potter and Draco Malfoy dolls. So if I could find them, I'll be doing a whole Harry Potter themed video for dolls. Guys, but don't, don't do drying Erica the way I did it. I only did this because, we, like I said before, we're in the middle of getting some, like, exterminations here. I'm in the middle of doctor's appointments. I got to go to later. We got a lot of stuff going on, guys. So, that's why my room looks all blown apart. You know, a mouse came in here and boomed and tingled over every doll I own. Not fun, guys. Look, look. He even did it to my shoes. Like, not cool, guys. Not cool. So, I'm putting 13, 14, I'm putting 6, day 6, which was washing Erica, and then 13 and 14 together, because I'm going to be showing you guys tomorrow what Erica is wearing and how she is dressed and how her skin came out. Okay, guys. Guys, happy Halloween day 14. So, today, guys, I have a doctor's appointment. So I have to hurry up. But this is how Miss Erica cleaned up. Yes, guys, laying her over two buckets is not an ideal way to clean her. 
Okay, see, she does have some marks I have to get out. I washed her with antibacterial soap and soap, like antibacterial soap, a toothbrush, and a magic eraser. So I think this is about as much as Miss Erica is going to get. She's going to go back in the box I have for my clean dolls to go into. I know, guys, look, she's on top of my brand new Harry Potter sweater only wore a couple of times. So, what do you think, Miss Erica? Good job, Mom. Who do you want your dad to be? I don't, don't want the dad to be your favorite grandpa. See, she loves her grandpa already. Mm -hmm. So, guys, meet Erica. Sorry, guys, you guys see that stuff in the background? That's a bag, a little shopping bag. Literal shopping bag. I have backpacking that has my most of my Barbie collection in it. I know, guys. We're getting this room cleaned up. Look at these wrinkles. Guys, I give this doll. She's a Madam Alexander. I'm sorry if I didn't say so earlier. I'll show you guys her next stamp. <clears throat> so, guys, she is a queen. I love her. Dad gave her to me for my birthday. Not this year. We just came. We were in it the year before that. I just haven't had a chance to clean Erica up until then. So, but she is a spectacle of beauty. Look at this queen. Guys, I'm taking off the bed sheets at the moment again because I'm about to change them and that kind of gets in the way when I'm filming. Guys, I am sorry that my Vlogoween videos are not like long, lent out videos like they usually are, guys. Trust me, I have a few that are coming. And I have a medical update video. It's not about me, so I don't want to get into details, guys. About why I'm along so why I'm away sometimes for time and time on end and what is going on. Because I'm having a medical issue. Not me personally, but a family member. So I just want to pop on here and let you guys know eventually, like what is going on with Borkson? Why isn't she updating the videos on the time as regular? Guys, that's why these little clip bits are vlogoween day to say, vlogoween day that day, vlogoween day to stay. It's just because, guys, my father is ill at the moment and I have to take care of him. Okay, guys, remember to comment, like, share, subscribe. Go to the bell for post notifications. Bye!